filming everything right here because I'm so lazy. I really don't even feel like filming right now, but I know that I need to. So I got a lot of shoes in. If you guys don't know, I did go back to work. So I didn't need work shoes because I'm not wearing scrubs. I'm wearing business casual outfits. I do have some haul videos and try-ons coming really soon as well. So I did get a lot of shoes. This was originally supposed to be an AMI Clubwear haul, but I did purchase some things as well. So I'm going to include everything, but I'm going to start off with AMI Clubwear. So I did get a pair of flats. These are by Olivia not sure what the name is at the bottom i'm gonna kind i'm gonna kind of try to go through this fastly because i do kind of have a lot of shoes um so yeah i picked up these flats they are super cute i love them i don't like flats let me tell y'all that i'm not a flats girl but i know that i have to get in the flats because sometimes i'm not gonna want to wear heels so i did pick these up they look like this they remind me of the valentino rock stud flats um but these run super big these are a six and a half and they are way too big i could probably fit a five or a five and a half like literally these are really really big so yeah and right now on the website they don't have them in the smaller size that i need um and they also do come in nude but they didn't have my size in that either which i guess that's not a bad thing because the six and a half is way too big um and yeah i usually wear a six and a half or a seven so if you wear a um eight you could probably fit those so yeah that's those and then i also did pick up some other little shoes now um particularly at my job the heel requirement is two and a half inches or less but for me i don't have any heels that are that length and um, my director really doesn't care so I tend to wear higher heels but of course it would be better if I could find some that were you know a little bit more easy on my legs and feet so I did pick up these kitten heels these are actually not you know like I think the shoe is really cute but I don't know if I can get into actually wearing these because of the heel but I did want to definitely test them out um, this is a six and a half and it does have a sling back so I think it makes it look a little bit cuter also it has the pointed toe in the front so i'm gonna try these out and see how i like them but i think these will be good for days um that i want to be a little bit more dressy but i don't feel like wearing a high heel and i have dyed at work in some of my super high heels so yeah i picked these up and i also got these in the new color spoiler alert because those should be coming up somewhere where are they have the same box as the first pair so this is the new ones. These are actually called the Camel Suede. And this style of shoe is called Tilly, T-I-L-L-Y. And the first style is Valley, V-A-L-L-E-Y, the flat ones with the studs. So this is the nude ones. I think these are super cute. Um, although they are kitten heel, that's not my thing, but I'm trying. So yeah, I got these as well. So we'll see how those turn out. If you guys want to know how a lot of this stuff looks, I'm going to try to do a try on for all of this, but it is a lot. So I may not, I may just show them to you. Um, but I do post on my Snapchat like every single day usually. And I kind of do a flash up and down of my outfit and I'm usually lit in the mornings because I go to work super early. So if you dogs haven't been following me on there, then you've missed them all. So yeah i also picked these up these are by liliana um and i like these because they do have a chunky heel and you guys know i like the clear strapped heels now i wore these not this particular pair i have another color but the clear part was hurting and i think it's because i got a seven and i should have got a six and a half because six and a half is my usual size um but i don't know maybe I don't know what it was maybe it could have been I think I put a shoe pad in did I put a shoe pad in I can't remember but it could have been that so this is the shoe this is the nude one um, and this style is bitsy b-i-t-s-y dash 37 so I got these in a seven and this is the nude color and I liked this part because you don't have to tie it all the way up the leg because those kinds tend to fall down when you're walking a lot so you can literally just wrap this around like once or twice and tie it and you'll be good to go. So I got these. For the most part, they are comfortable because the heel is not super high and it is a chunky heel. But the clear part was cutting into my foot. 
So I don't know. I will have to figure that out. Um, and then also I did pick up the black ones as well. The black ones look a little crazy because yeah, I did have a shoe pad in. So it's a little bit of that sticky stuff right there. And this part looks a little dusty because I did wear them. But yeah, this is the black pair and they have the little gold on the ends. I wore these recently i can't even remember what i wore them with oh actually i had worn an all red jumpsuit on valentine's day um and i had paired these shoes with it so those are the black ones um and then also i did get some more items from them these are all flat shoes and sandals and things like that because it is it has been a little warm lately but i'm sure it's gonna cool back off a bit so i did get some flats um i got these flat sandals or no i got this pair of flats um and i feel like these would be great these are not particularly my style edge does not i don't like flats but i think these would be great for days when i wear heels and i want to have some flats in case my feet are hurting like to walk out to the car or if i'm gonna be walking around whatever so i got these they're really simple and they have a little bow on the front they kind of look like little slippers or whatever um, they, they're not foldable flats, so I need to get a pair of those that I can kind of just keep, you know, at work or something. But yeah, I picked these up with the intentions to wear them, like with the outfit, but they just look so plain. I don't know if I would. Um, these are six and a half, and they're a round toe, little ballet type of flat. I also did pick up this pair of flats. These are really cute. I could totally see myself you know pairing an outfit around these and wanting to wear them because they are really pretty although i don't like flats but these are really cute because they have diamonds in the buckle at the toe if you guys can see the details on that i'm not sure but they're really pretty like diamonds or you know crystals in like a buckle and they are a round toe i do like the pointed toe ones a lot better but i wanted to pick up some round toes so that's how these look these are six and a half they do have some cushioning on the inside as well and they're kind of like a suede type of material they feel really smooth these are some sandals these boxes are so small and cute um now these are really really cute i love these they look like this and they are beaded if you guys can see that and it's like a pink like a golden yellow color um black white and then like a nice turquoise green so i picked these up these will be super cute you can pair them with all black or if you have one of these colors that will be really cute as well um you know pair it with black along with it so i got those and then i also got a similar pair um and these are the new ones that are the same now these actually have gold the yellow color pink nude and white and I do have a white dress with a gold buckle type detail on it. And I think these will be super cute paired with that. So that's probably what I will put it with. And then, you know, of course, find other stuff that I can wear them with. But those are really cute. And then I also did pick up another pair. I wanted the black ones as well, but the black ones were out in my size. So I'll probably get them when they do come back. But this is a new pair of sandals. And they have like a caged detailing on the front with silver studs on them um with nude a lot of times you wear like gold jewelry usually but the silver is pretty as well and i actually have a denim dress that has silver buttons on it so i think this will be super cute to pair with that for a more casual type of look and then i also picked up this pair um and these are a pair with a bow on the front and these are just black with the bow and then they kind of have like a gold detailing this part is plastic which i don't really like and i feel like it makes them look kind of cheapy um i probably would have preferred for them to not have anything right there because then i could have paired these with just about anything um but yeah i want to find me another pair with a bow that's you know like a better quality but these are cute aldo had some but they're sold out so I don't know but these are cute for what they are and i would still wear them um you know with something black and you know if i'm gonna do like gold accessories or something really cute so that's everything that i got from ami club wear i'm just kind of stacking everything back in the, this box to get it out of my way
Also, I was quite surprised that I had this in my package. And this is a sample of the Sugar Bear hair um, vitamins, which are basically kind of like gummy vitamins. And you get this whole little bottle, which I thought was a really cute sample that they included because this is a really cute sample. Like, you know, a lot of times stuff will come with like one or two, but this is really cute. I haven't tasted them or tried them at all. Vitamins usually break me out like crazy, so I haven't been taking any whatsoever. So yeah, that's that. Um, now I'm gonna move into some other things that I got. I have a few items that are from tbdress.com. Um, and I think one of the items may be back ordered or I'm not sure if it even is coming, but I have four of the items here, so I'm just going to include them in this haul. So this is one of the boxes for the shoes. I think this box is so cute. Like, look at that. This is so cute and detailed. So yeah, I picked up a few shoes. Some of them can be worn to work or, you know, everything in this video is not doesn't have to be worn to work but I got these and I felt like the heel wasn't too high so these will be good for work um, and then they do have the black with the clear um, that just look like this so yeah I thought these were cute um, I'm not sure what this brand is get these in a size 37 because their shoes do come in European sizes so that is that pair um, and then I also did pick up a pair of flats and I did um, buy some flats as well if I would have known that I was gonna buy those I probably wouldn't have picked these on this website um, but they're different so it doesn't really matter so this is how they look they do have a bow on the front I think these are really cute actually although I don't like flats but I think they're really cute um, and they are like a velvety kind of feels like felt velvety type of material I don't know so yeah, I got these, um, and this is a size 37 as well. And then the next thing that I got from them was this pair of shoes. These are really cute. You know, you don't have to wear these to work, but I think they would be cute for work or even away from work. They are studded, and they just look kind of expensive. They, the box is pretty heavy, and this is how the shoe looks. It is studded all over, even on the sides, both sides the heel and the back and even on the strap and I just thought these were really cute um, I haven't tried to wear them the heel doesn't look too high and it is a chunkier heel so you know you probably wouldn't have as much trouble walking in it but some of this stuff I may end up using for work or I can wear it otherwise um, but yeah I thought these were really cute and I like the studded detail on these got one more pair of shoes now whenever I saw these on the website I thought they would be cute for work but whenever I got them in I felt like the heel is a little high um, I don't know I'll have to really try them on to see but they do give me like modest stripper vibes because they do have stripper shoes that are made like this but of course it has a platform so here's how the shoe looks let me take this paper out so here's how it looks it is a booty with the cutout on the back and a cutout in the front and then here is the heel on it and then it laces up right here and it also zips on the inside it kind of has a lot going on with it but they're really cute they do have some stripper heels that are made like this with this same type of detailing but of course they have a really thick platform so that's why I said these are kind of like modest stripper heels and they do have um, a liner on the bottom protecting it that you would just peel off like so. So yeah. I think these are really cute though. Um, and yeah, I needed a really cute pair of booties anyway, so I really like these. They smell really good. kind of smells like leather, but I do believe they are a faux leather material. Not really sure but I got those everything else are things that I picked up myself the first few items from AMI Clubwear as well as TV dress were sent to me so yeah I picked up some items from nine West because I know that they have shoes that are more comfortable um, and yeah I was just looking on their well really I was looking all around for some flats that would be cute that would suit me um, but then I came across these so I ended up getting them so this is how they look I will take the paper out to really give you guys a view of how they look because you want to put the paper back in so that your shoe can keep its form and if you guys can see the bow stands up on the shoe it is a pointed toe they are leather and this part is kind of like a suede material but this part is leather the back is leather it has the cutout in the middle 
and yeah these are just really really cute flats i really like these a lot um and the bow the way that it stands up and everything reminded me of my amina abdul jalil heels that have the bow on the side and the bow fluffs out because it does have it came like this and you know that's how i always store them so my bow will keep its shape so that's what i do with these as well so that the bow stands up some people may not like that because it's probably a little bit much but i really like that and it gives the shoe a different type of look so i really like these and these i got in a size six and a half and they fit perfectly um the only thing with flats is that they can rub up against the back of your heel and that can be really annoying I do have some of those little heel shoe pads which I probably should have used. I've only worn them once so they aren't broken in but they are super cute. Next I picked up another pair from Nine West which is kind of like the same thing but with the heel. I haven't worn these yet but I just thought they were cute so I ended up getting them. So this is how they look. I do have a small heel but I feel like this heel is a little bit higher than like a kitten heel. Um, but yeah, I think they're really cute and they do have that bow detail on the front and it sticks up. I will take it out right here. This one is not as high up as the other one. I probably could make it higher if I wanted to stuff a bigger piece of paper in there where it would stand up even more. But yeah, this is how this one is made. These are leather once again and then this little piece right here is kind of like suede or it's kind of like it's leather but it's flipped on the opposite side. Yeah, that's basically what it is. It's flipped on the opposite side on both of them. And then you have the cutout in the middle and then the back part. And they're made exactly the same pretty much. Except one is a flat and one has a little heel on it. So I picked both of these up because I thought they were cute. Next pair of shoes that I picked up are by Halston. Um, and you can find these at Dillard's. The Nine West ones I did purchase from the Nine West website. And these I purchased from the Dillard's website because Dillard's were out of my size. And I thought these were super cute. I actually should have worn these the other day, but I forgot that I had them because I've been buying so much stuff. But this is how these look. They are kind of like a suede type of material. Um, and it's just a really pretty sandal. And I really like the heel on it because it's so different and cute. And it's not too high, so it's great for work. And it goes to a point, if you guys can kind of see that. And then that's the side of it. Like it's just a really cute heel. Um, and that's how it goes. Like it has that curve there. Like it's just, I don't know. It's just really different and cute. But they're also very good for work. Because the heel is not too high. It's still higher than what is recommended. But I think they're really cute. So yeah, I picked these up as well. And they were on sale. Cost them. It's kind of expensive, I think, but I got them on sale. So, <clears throat> lastly, I picked up a lot of flat sandals because, like I said, it's going to be warming up really soon and we can wear flat sandals. So, that will make it a lot easier on my feet where I don't have to worry about wearing heels. I can still dress up um, and just wear some flat sandals. Um, so, yeah, I picked up a lot of sandals from Go Jane. Um, yeah, I just shared them with you guys. So I picked this one up. I thought these were really cute. You guys know I live for black and white and I was picturing this, you know, like with an all black outfit or like a black dress or something would be really cute. So this is how they look and they do kind of have like a bunching effect where they're kind of like more rippled. And I don't know, I just thought these were really cute. And whenever I was looking at them on the website, they were sold out in every size except for my size. So I was like... Honey, let me snatch these up because I like black and white. And since everybody buying them, they must be, you know, hot like I need them. So I picked those up. Um, and all these boxes and stuff are kind of thrown around. I also picked up this pair. And these look like this. And originally, whenever I was looking for flat sandals, I was looking at the Steve Madden website. And I had seen some that were similar to this and also another pair um and for those particular ones it was going to cost me quite a bit but i ended up getting all of these shoes way less of course quality is better than quantity but a lot of these sandals quality is actually really good for you know coming from gojane and these are like liliana different brands that um 
and my club wear carries and stuff but they didn't have these particular sandals so i got these and these have rhinestones all in them and they're black so i feel like these look really cute and dressy um and yeah the rhinestones are a nice quality it is like on a strip with the rhinestones in them i may end up trying to find a better pair um but yeah i don't know i think these are really cute these came in like silver as well if i'm not mistaken um and then i also did pick up this pair of sandals which is really simple they just have the black straps and these were really inexpensive with they had a discount code and i think i only paid like five dollars or something for these so that's a really great deal and they came in a lot of colors they also had them in patent leather with a lot of colors as well um, but I just went for them. These are kind of like a suede material. So I also picked them up in like this tan type of color. I think it's called Mocha on the website or something. But these are how they look. And I wore these Friday with an orange dress. Like a burnt orange type of dress with my denim jacket. So really cute and simple. So I picked those up. I also picked up this pair that look like this. And these kind of have like a twisted bowl type of detailing, but they are, you know, kind of to the side. And this is kind of like a suede material and they look like this. I really like when black sandals have the black sole as well, especially if you're going to be wearing like all black or, you know, something more businessy. I feel like the all black looks better versus having that inside be like a tan color. So... I like these and I've worn those already as well. I also picked up these. I really wanted some that just had like the gold across the toe without the back because I kind of feel like sometimes whenever it has a back to it like this with a strap, it makes me feel like a kid, like little girl sandals or something. But I don't know. I thought these were cute and they do have like a crackled effect. I will probably end up still buying some that just have that strap across um, like a gold pair and a silver pair, but we can't wear sandals that go between the toe Which is why all of these sandals are, you know, just a band across because all of my sandals that I own Are sandals that go between the toes. So I was like I need to buy me some sandals like I need to stock up because I'm not gonna wear heels all the time So yeah, I thought these were really cute and the effect on them are really pretty. They kind of look like glitter And you know, they just look even more metallic because it kind of has that foiled crispy crunchy type of effect i don't know but yeah and these all have like a little bit of cushioning in them which is really good so i got these in gold and i also got them in the silver this one still has the thing in it because i haven't messed with it but yeah this is the silver pair and yeah you can never go wrong with like gold and silver nude black whatever like those are like the basic colors and then I will add on from there and start getting like pops of color red, things like that. Really quick, I was just editing my shoe video and I did purchase a few more shoes since filming that video. And since I haven't put it up yet, I decided I would include these items as well because these are recent purchases. Also, work type of shoes are things that you can wear for the summer or whatever. So let's get into those. Pick up a pair of sneakers. I showed these on my snap and a lot of you dolls love them. These are very similar to the Balenciaga shoes. Mine's are a little bit dirty around the bottom because I did wear them to the fair, which was probably the wrong thing to do because you dolls know it's like dirty on the ground and stuff and people throwing trash and food and stuff like that. But I love these for the summertime. I love the colors of them. They do have yellow and then you have this blue color. It's like knitted right here in the front. And then you have like a red, it's kind of like a red orange and then like a teal color. You have the blue on the back and also nude. So I feel like these can go with so much stuff. So like that the strings are black and white. Um, and I do also like that it has the cutout here because it definitely makes it more of like a summer type of sneaker. And we do have work t-shirts like collar shirts. And I ordered some shirts that would match with these very well. So I can just pair it with like some black pants on a day whenever I want to be more casual. And then my shoes will be really cute and popping, right? Or I can just pair it with black pants or whatever and put like a cute little t-shirt on if I want to as well. I did wear these to the fair with a shirt that kind of has like this netted detail. 
and just some jeans so it was really cute as well so you can definitely wear these whenever you want to i got these in a six and a half and these are by steve madden i got them from the steve madden website these also do come in other colors as well but i really love these colorful ones all these items right here are from steve madden that i am showing you so this next pair look like this they are clear and you guys know i love my clear heels so whenever i seen that they had a flat sandal that was clear I was like okay I gotta have those because I can wear this with so much stuff so it just has clear across the toe and then also right here you have this little piece and it is stretchy this is supposed to go across your foot like you just wear it like this but I feel like these are good because you can kind of switch it up and wear them different ways you can pull this to the back and wear it more like a sling back like that so it's kind of like two styles in one just whichever way you want to wear them so these are really cute and they are bendable so they're very comfortable and yeah I got these in a six and a, no I got these in a seven I usually buy my flat sandals in a seven so these are a seven. This pair that I picked up I didn't get these off of the Steve Madden website um they didn't have these on the site but they do have some that are similar it doesn't have this piece across it just has like two large straps so if you want those, you can get them there. But I did find these on Amazon and this is how they look. They're really crystal and pretty. These are great for work as well. But they are super blingy so you can pair them with a lot of stuff. I have also worn these on the weekend. You know, so you can wear these anytime in the summer and they're just really pretty and blingy. And I like the detail that they have. My other ones that I have are a thong and we can't wear thongs. So I've been buying a lot of sandals that have the straps that go across. So that is these they don't have any cushioning in them i wore these to the mall one day when me and my mom were shopping for quite a while and my feet were dead because they are so flat and they don't have a cushion in them so if you're going to be walking a lot i would advise to put like a little shoe pad in there so you can have some type of cushion but they work great for work because i don't do a whole lot of walking we do have to walk quite a bit from the parking lot to the building and then you guys know hospitals are huge so you know you do do some walking but my feet are usually okay to wear these for work and i have worn them quite a bit the bottom definitely shows that but i love these lastly this pair right here you dolls loved these whenever i posted these on my snapchat and for easter me and my mom both picked these up um and we ended up dressing alike for easter to go to easter dinner after church so this is how these look i want you dolls to really see these crystals they are so pretty very very blingy and we got these from dillard's um i believe they have them on the steve madden website but whenever i was looking on there they had a black bottom but i believe the colors of the stones were the same and i just seen that they have a pair that look just like this but the stones are clear in them so i'm probably going to pick those up as well because those will be really cute and you can pair them with so many things because the stones are clear I love wearing these they look really pretty paired with like something blue I've worn these with a pair of light pink pants that are similar to this stone and then like a floral shirt with that had like a lot of different colors in it and it was like navy with different color flowers so it looked really good with these as well and these are made very nicely I don't feel like the stones are gonna fall out and they're not just glued on here they are sewn on and you guys know I love my clear heels and sandals and stuff so I love these so much so yeah these are really cute for the summer oh yeah that's all the stuff that i wanted to add in for you dolls so yeah back to the video but yeah these are all of the shoes that i purchased recently for work oh i'm lying there was another pair but i didn't grab them for this video because i'm pretty sure a lot of these shoes you can still find on these websites but this particular pair was a pair that i purchased from burlington co factory they are steve madden um but they have like a leather they have the leather across the toe with the back out and they are a peep toe and then they have a really thick chunky clear heel super cute love those shoes to death and i got them so cheap they were only like 12 dollars because they were marked down i'm not sure why maybe somebody bought them returned them they didn't look worn but i don't know they were on sale i got them for a good deal and steve madden can be expensive a lot of shoes can run at least a hundred dollars whenever they first come out so yeah i didn't include those if you guys follow me on snap you've probably seen them but yeah you probably can't find those anywhere so i didn't want to include them but that's everything that i got um you guys can check out in my club wear um tv dress go jane um nine west as well as dealers that's where everything came from i will put 
I will try to put links down below for every single item that I showed in this video. I don't know that I'm going to do a try on for all of these items because it's just so much stuff. Um, but yeah, that's it for this video. If you guys have questions, leave them down below. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye, dolls. Bye.